Darts Nuts and welcome to Darts Review Channel. In this video I'm reviewing the Winmore Calibra from the Winmore 2019 range. And this has got the new matrix grip on the barrels and these are the 26 gram. You can also get them in 22 grams and 24 grams and they're 90% tungsten and they have the black onyx coating on the barrels. And these retail for £56.99, so let's check them out. So the darts come in this cardboard packaging, uh, like the other Winmore darts that I've reviewed. And uh, it's got a nice big window when you lift the flap up, and got a nice detailed graphic of the barrels. And um, inside you've got a form inset holding everything in place. And the comb supplied with the Winmore little uh, aluminium and plastic round point protector and you've got a set of medium prism force stems and you've got a set of standard shape prism alpha flights. So the darts are fit with the free floor points which has got the built in trident so you get a a smooth transition from the point to the nose of the barrel. The actual barrel itself starts on this uh, silvery tungsten part here and obviously it's your classic uh, bullet style. Um, very nice looking dart really, it's uh, a lot nicer now that I've got it in my fingers than I thought it was when I seen the first pictures of it and the onyx coating it gives it a nice look and also the way the uh, the light catches on the uh, matrix grip and it's a similar style to a nail grip but a nail grip is actually uh, pressed into the barrel and usually pressed on a straight part of a barrel whereas this has been actually milled into the barrel and you can actually see that um, it looks as if it's a wider um, groove sections on there and thinner ones on the rear but grip wise it's still quite similar to nail grip um, I don't think it's overly grippy got quite a nice feel but I'd say at best it's around about medium but on the uh, front part there of the matrix grip near where the ring is it just feels a little bit more grippy there maybe because I'm just catching the edges a little bit more but sits quite comfortable in the fingers and you could use it for rear grippers as well if that's your uh, style of barrel but obviously it's a fairly short barrel and there's your prism four stems and your Winmore prism alpha flights it's got a kind of a etched pattern on them That's fitted with the black coated 29mm free floor points with the built in trident. The front of the barrel has got a silvery section and a groove that's 1.9mm and then you've got a wide smooth section with the Winmore logo that's 5.1mm and then another silver ring and two grooves of 3.1mm and on the front you've got the first section of the matrix grip which is 14.1 millimeters wide and then you've got another silvery band and a couple of thin grooves that's 4.3 millimeters the rear section of the matrix grip slopes towards the end of the barrel that's 12.7 millimeters and then you've got another small silvery band and groove of 2 millimeters length is 43.2 millimeters width is 7.9 millimeters twenty six point zero seven grams twenty six point zero seven grams again and twenty six point one grams and the full setup is twenty seven point eight four grams 
with nothing attached the balance is towards the front and with the supplied setup it moves pretty much to the center point and this is the balance with medium in between short extra short stems and standard flights Definitely a front weighted balanced feel to the dart. Um, quite a chunky uh, front part as well, but obviously it's that style of dart, so it's going to be like that. But um, for me, as a front gripper, I think it's probably one of them darts that suits a slightly uh, loopy style of throw. Um, Fairly smooth, just a little bit of fish tailing, but on the all it's flying quite smooth. But grip wise, um, this doesn't feel as grippy as it looks. It still kind of feels more like a medium feel. Um, got a nice feel to the grip, but it's I don't know. It just seems like a like a bigger version of nail gripper. That's about as close as I can describe it. But I think the coating on the barrel is adding a little bit to the grip. So I'll try it from the middle section now. It's only a short dart, so the grip it's not moving up massively. Um, obviously it's a heavier dart than what I normally throw. And obviously with it being front weighted it feels a little bit more heavier on the front than it would if it was my normal weight. For some reason I'm getting more spin from the middle section. But yeah, that's quite a nice arc. And I think that's just because it's like bulbous front. But if you like nail grip and you want to try something similar but Maybe just a little bit grippier and a little bit of a slightly different feel and definitely give them a try. So I'm uh, trying on the rear section now so obviously the barrel is thinner and it's probably going to feel even more foot weighted. The first one spun a lot but the second one and the last one were very smooth, just not on target. But it does feel a little bit more front heavy now. So if you're a rear gripper that likes the front weight of that, then you should be fine. But I think it's going to suit uh, front grippers the best. But if you're middle and front, uh, middle and rear gripper, and you like that style of that, then you're probably going to uh, want to give them a try anyway. Quite an interesting feel to the grip. So there you go, the Winmore Calibra. Um, quite a nice little dart. It's uh, one for front grippers, I think, mostly. But like I already said, if it's the sort style of dart you like, and you're a middle and rear gripper, uh, worth a try. Around the middle. It's got that smooth band there, but you're still getting some of the grip either side.
but it's an interesting feel that grip um, like I said it, it, it does have a kind of a nail feel but like a more bobbly like pronounced nail and that's as close as I can describe it really but as a front gripper for me um, it was flying quite smooth and had quite a nice arc and obviously it's nice and chunky at the front which I don't mind the feel of that but uh, a good looking dart and quite an interesting uh, one as well so that's the end of the review thanks for watching